night after midnight at Emo Fight. I was on the call for that one, but Sandra here. Oh, that was, you know, last night, Joey Janela's spring break, that was another place that Steph Delander and Matt Cardona just showed up. Yeah. And um, Steph Delander got her ass beat by Maja Slamovich. Yeah, just who say. is, by the way, the champ just of say. GCW. She is a GCW world champion. Hello. Also, don't talk about this is going to be your show and how you're wrestling here instead of at some other show. All right, you're at WrestleGania, friend who's making your debut here. You're lucky to be on the show. There are so many other queer wrestlers that would love to be on the show, so don't be smack talking. Whoa. Well, and lightning in a bottle, looking to end Steph Delander's gay brunch run quickly. The powerhouse predator. You might think that you're the baddest bitch on the Indies, and I do respect her. Steph Delander is one hell of a wrestler. SDL got Sandra up on the shoulders. Sandra rolling through victory roll. And she does have a lot of power behind her. Don't get me wrong. I mean, I do respect Steph Delander for the strength, the power, and the fact that, you know, she has been wrestling six years now. She is fantastic. But man, I, Veda, I'm just going to say it. And I'm sorry. I'll but let I feel, you say it. I feel, I'll let you say it. I feel like I'm allowed to. And I'm sorry if I disappoint anybody, okay? Because, you know, I'm pretty happy-go-lucky and stuff, but she's a cunt. There, I said Ow! it. But as Val Ow! Cunt, as Val Cunt Pone, I'm allowed to say it, and I'm sorry if I disappointed anybody or anybody's grandmas, but I love you grandmas. Well, okay. if your grandma is watching Gay Brunch, um, she understands. Yeah, so. thank you grandmas. My grandma's no longer with us, but Steph Delander, you're a cunt. There, I said it. In the Australian way, in, in the Australian way. So that makes it okay. It's like I'm a jag off because I'm from Chicago. I said it that many times. There, there you go. Okay, bam, oh. right there. Are you, are you okay, Val? <laughs> no, you I had a moment. Oh, look, you my had hand a broke. I'm wearing the velvet, but I'm also wearing my Doc Martens, so I have to see it. But Sandra's kicking Steph's ass, and that's all that matters. And absolutely everyone is cheering for Sandra here. Everyone, it's only been a few weeks, Val, and everyone is already tired of Steph Delander and Matt Cardona. I mean, really, why are you coming here to ruin Effie Gay LA? It's WrestleGania. Oh, but no, Sandra sent hard into the post. Steph Delander able to recover. But I feel like here's the thing, is you have to give everybody a chance. So maybe if we like turn, okay, now I'm trying to turn the tides here. Maybe if we turn around and welcome Steph with open arms and educate her on how to not be a see you, in, see you next Tuesday, like, then maybe she will be part of the community and loving and kind. And well, now she's looking for a win. I mean, to, to be fair, Val, a win in your Gay Brunch debut. I mean, that would be a, a heck of a thing for Steph oh. Delander, especially because she had her official she had her official GCW match debut last night at Joey Janela's Spring Break, and as I mentioned, got her ass beat by Macho Slam. Well, now, I was watching it on Fight TV at my hotel room, resting up and getting ready to rock commentary with you because you are our, uh, the yes. uh, goddess, a, a genius, and thank you for letting me rock the mic with you. Um, and so I was watching it, and uh, she challenged for the title yes. out of nowhere did get her ass kicked. Uh, she wasn't even in any ring gear. Which well, Matt, Gar and Matt Cardona interfering liberally. I have not seen, I have not seen Matt Cardona uh, around this morning. No, so, so that's delightful. We should be safe. Yeah, that's delightful, I feel oh, like. Oh, but wait, I didn't see this either. Sandra Moon mounting a big comeback, trying to get the lander out of the corner, but the lander just too strong. Wait, but Moon oh. puts on the brakes and puts up the boot. There you go. Springboard cross body to Delander. And there's some strength coming from Moon. Yes, the, the powerhouse predator does have the size advantage, but Moon does have power in her own boots as well. She did get taken out by that huge back elbow from Delander. Delander almost in for that pin. But the crowd behind Sandra, I believe, is what's going to pow power Sandra up. What well, an FTL taking more than a moment to uh, interact with the fans here. So, Steph Delander is kind of just getting used to that aspect of independent pro wrestling. You know, normally on TV, you play to the cameras. But here she has to deal with these rabid fans 
at Epi Gay LA. And I'm just gonna say it, that we are. Us fans are rabid. Cause you know, I like to do the fan analysis. I like to represent. Yeah, we the, like to get the perspective. The common jag off, yes. <laughs> and oh, Sandra Moon uh -oh. With is a in trouble, hug, yeah. yeah. The powerhouse predator showing off that power. Sandra is trying to break this hold in some way, any way she can, elbow blows. But Delander, Delander finally forced to free, free Sandra, who fires back with a missile drop kick. Here we go, Moon. Oh, oh, not quite finger licking, oh. good. Oh, no. Delander almost pulled this off. Moon writhing in pain. Oh no. Now Delander should be taking advantage of this. Instead, she's just being a bully to Sandra. To say one thing positive about Steph Delander, she has endless reserves of confidence. Oh. oh. But when that confidence borders on the edge of cockiness, that's just gonna come back to bite her in the ass. Well, you know, some, some people might say the same thing about Matt Cardona, a level of delusion as right. Sandra Moon firing back on point. Oh, oh. Just like that, Delander. Big boot out of the corner. Sandra Moon might be out and Steph Delander is down too. And our referees checking on both competitors, starting a count. Shout out Perch, has a lot of the big matches of the weekend, was the official for the main event yesterday, Val. DDT versus GCW, watch the impact of this boot. Perch refereeing the Ready Daddy. You, I know one of your favorites, Cole Radrick versus Absolutely. Yoshihiko. Oh, intensity. Oh, not, not many could keep control, but Perch, always one of the best. Now making the count, I would hate to see the match end in a double count, but oh. No, they're both the climbing to back up. Feet. Yep. Speaking of intensity, look at the look on the face of Sandra Moon as she hooks the arm and elbows to the face of SDL. Powering the spine of Steph Delander. Beautiful comeback from Sandra Moon. Here we go. Here we go. Is it finger licking good? There it is. <laughs> looking for Moon's landing, up? but Delander just too strong. Huge back suplex. Running uppercut to the back of the head, Sandra Moon. Three, oh, oh. No. no, 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 so, so, oh. so close. Oh, my stars. I saw splashes of mimosa flying up. Nobody could believe it. <laughs> I saw a lot of glitter. Sandra Moon looking to take a big risk as the lander. Nails Moon with a forearm step to Lander. Running kick through the face. Oh. The Lander with the cover. Oh, kicking out Sandra Moon. We have seen it time and again, Val. There is no one as resilient as Sandra Moon. And this is exactly why the fans get behind her. Oh. Whoa. Another big combo by Moon, who once again starts the climb. Missile drop kick, taking down SDL. Sandra Moon crawling into the cover. And Delander, to her credit, still in it. Steph Delander, an amazing competitor, even if we could do without all the everything yeah, else. Everything else, yes. I was gonna say all the everything else. And the company she chooses to keep. Now Moon's landing, Sandra with the wait coverage. A minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh. Oh. What a forearm by Delander, but wait, Moon chasing behind. Guts caught up on the shoulders oh, no. and planted. Step Delander. Oh. Oh, as much. Step Delander.
Lander. Steph Delander. And I cannot believe I'm saying this. Victorious.